Hey partners, we are back here again with another Kajabi Partner interview. This time we're talking to Aunt Hodges, who is an amazing Kajabi Partner from London. And Aunt is gonna talk all about social media and how he uses it to differentiate himself and his partner business. So let's jump right into the interview. Hello, thank you so much, Ant, for joining me today to talk a little bit about your strategy as a Kajabi partner as it pertains to social media and how you use social media to grow your referral base. Um, would love for you to take a second to introduce who you are, what your business is, and uh, what you've been doing so far as a Kajabi partner. Awesome, and um, it's an honor to, to be sat here chatting um, across the pond. So I'm based in the UK. I run a small agency team. Um, and we help course creators and experts create their courses and market them. And then I have a training program called Knowledgepreneur, where members will then join me for weekly coaching and, um, and mentoring through that process as well. Um, the whole Kajabi Partner Program has just been, um, it's just another string to the bow of the, of the offering that we have. And I joined right in the founder's days I'm now at Emerald status within the partner program um, and looking looking to get to the, the next step um, as quickly as I can because um, I, is it platinum that's next after Emerald? Diamond and then platinum. Diamond. Yes. Diamond. I got my silver certificate at the Impact Conference. Yeah, I love um, it. But just want to get to that diamond level um, because of the extra swag and bonuses and how generous you guys are in the partner program so yeah thank you for sharing that and for those of you who are watching who don't know what ant's talking about um at 50 active referrals we offer our partners a 500 dollars a month bonus cash bonus on top of your 30 percent commission and then when you get to 100 active referrals you get a thousand dollars a month on top of your commission so it is definitely a um a level and tier to aim for and i can't wait to to see you hit that hit that level level. Um, but I'd love to ask you, what do you do currently? What's your strategy as a Kajabi partner? Obviously you, you teach marketing and you teach online business strategies and that's kind of your whole world, but how do you start to weave in your Kajabi partner link, um, specifically on social, but honestly, you can speak to anything you do. Um, how do you, how do you drive business, uh, for your Kajabi partner link? So, um, the offer to, get access to Kajabi and to start using Kajabi as a business system is the key differentiation that I have when I talk about Kajabi. Um, I talk about Kajabi not just being a platform to host your website or to host your courses, but I talk about it being the business system, the, the only business system that I recommend experts, course creators, coaches, trainers, consultants use to run their entire business. So I, I talk about it from a, a copy perspective or a language perspective in that way so that whenever I get any kind of inquiry, part of the process of qualifying people is, are you, do you use a system currently to host your courses, your website, your emails, um, to take your money? And I ask within pre-qualification questionnaires or conversations those questions so that I can deduce whether they're a Kajabi user or not. If they're not a Kajabi user in those things, then part of the process would be for them to, or for me to recommend that they get Kajabi. Yeah. And I have a link that is my domain um, forward slash Kajabi that hosts um, different things. So when different promotions are running, I will change um, based on the promotions that you guys run. But I will have partner bonuses that they will get access to if they were to sign up to Kajabi. And that might include time with me, strategic time with me. It might include guides and wireframes on how to do certain things. But more than that, I think for me, the way in which I drive it is just being consistently me in social media, mm -hmm. consistently my message of how to market, grow, and scale a knowledge-based business. And Kajabi being one of the things that I mention as an important foundation of having a knowledge-based business online. I absolutely love the way that you framed that because I think it feels so authentic to who you are and what you offer. Um, and it becomes less of a, an affiliate marketing push and more of a like, this is truly just integrated into how I do business. If you don't wanna use this platform and you don't wanna use the strategies I have, maybe we're not the right fit in terms of clients um, because this is how we operate and it's just a part of the ecosystem. So 
I really appreciate that that outlook on things. And then the other thing I want to note, there's two things that you said that I think are like massively important. And, and everyone who is watching, I think you should stop and take some notes right now. The first thing is, well, let me back up by saying social media is just the channel in which you are bringing these things to life. So it could look different across it could look, I mean, it could look the same across uh, email or YouTube or, you know, Instagram or whatever channel it might be, but you're going to say specifically social media, right? But the thing that I think is so brilliant that you're doing that every partner, it's so simple, but every partner should do this is one, having a landing page. I love that it's just your, you know, URL slash Kajabi. Every person right now who has a domain can go do that and create a landing page that feels authentically true to your business that shares the value props as to why you choose Kajabi and what you've done with it and kind of the structure of how you see um, your audience using it. And the most important thing to note is that you know your audience better than Kajabi knows their, our, your audience, right? That's the thing that makes you a partner is that you can speak to their specific pain points and the things that you know that they're asking. And so that landing page can be filled with information about how Kajabi can best work for them. And that's going to look different across every single partner in their industry, in their community. So one, if you don't have a Kajabi partner landing page that you built yourself, and like Ant said, you, you update it with current offers, you probably keep it fresh with new FAQs, all that stuff. That's number one. I think it's brilliant. The second thing that you mentioned is the bonuses. And this kind of ties into the landing page as well, which is you probably switch up every so often when you have new bonuses available, you put that on that landing page and convey that value offer. Um, and I want you to speak a little bit about what those bonuses have unlocked and also how you share those things on social media. Cause I know one of the biggest questions I get is like, how do I differentiate myself? Like as a partner, I want to, you know, make 10, 15, 20 referrals, but it feels like it's a really crowded space. And it feels like I don't have anything that's differing than, you know, if they just go to kajabi.com or if they see some other partner online. So one, how do you differentiate? And then two, how do bonuses kind of play into that? I think for me, being authentically me in social media is so important. Mm -hmm. And it's not about um, sharing every moment of my life, warts and all, in social media, but it's about being authentically me about my understanding my true calling and what I'm supposed to be doing and understanding why I do what I do in business. And then weaving that in. I liken a lot of um, the thinking that I have around this I mean, I've been an affiliate marketer for a long time with lots of different things. Um, and I think for me, the, the biggest thing that I found with Kajabi is that it dovetails into my business more perfectly than anything else. Mm. It's not that I need to be an affiliate or a promotional partner for a product that I either don't use or that I don't believe in myself, and I'm doing it to make money. I actually am walking the talk in this by saying, I'm a user, I'm a Kajabi founder. I was even a Kajabi classic user back in the day and joined it in 2012. And I've used it and stuck with it. I've built my businesses on it. So I tell my story of how I've used Kajabi. And that's probably how I differentiate myself from other partners mm. in that sense, because I will talk about my business in conjunction with how I've utilized Kajabi in that sense. And then the second thing, the bonuses come from really understanding the clients that problems and their frustrations that they have um, right at the start of their journey and being able to give bonuses that will help them accelerate the success that they get or accelerate the rate at which they get success. So it might be a specific call with me so that they can basically just get all the nuts and bolts set up properly walking that through, which I know you guys offer as well as part of a setup. Um, but it might be a wireframe guide on what are the basic website pages that I need to get set up and what content should be on those pages. An about page, a contact page, the home page, the store page, a landing page, um, maybe a sales page template and walking, you know, and a guide walking them through those things. But I think the bonuses have got to dovetail into the fact that they're going to be jumping into a system that they've then got to learn how to use. And my bonuses help them to do that, but they are so intrinsically linked with the business as well. Yeah. So it's not alien. 
to all of the other social media that they might see where I might not be talking about Kajabi. I'm still going to be talking about how to build your list, how to generate more sales online, how to create a great online course. And my preferred method is Instagram. That's really where my home is um, and, and growing that. And we've kind of nailed it as a team. And we're just starting to look at YouTube as another channel now. Um, and we've got the Facebook group growing and things like that. But they're the main avenues. I don't tend to run paid traffic through the offers or anything like that because then that's going to a very cold audience. Yeah. I find that if people are already engaged with me in social, have built some kind of relationship with me, and then see me position an offer like that, then they're more inclined to take it from that recommendation because they've built the relationship with me and see the value in the other content that I've already provided. One thing I want to ask just to close out this session is um, what's one piece of advice that you would give for partners who are maybe at that, you know, five referral mark and are looking to to scale, looking to get to that Emerald 25 mark um, and are, are looking to you for advice? What, what would you suggest to them? Just look for a way in which you can blend Kajabi into what you're offering in your business in some way, shape or form um, so that when they get in, they are getting you as well as Kajabi. Um, I think for me, the, the biggest asset is the fact that they have built a relationship with you. Okay. So if they built a relationship with you, look at a way in which you can blend it in some way into your business so that that relationship continues when they get Kajabi as well. That would be the, the icing on the cake, if it were, because I know I have stickability within the referrals that I get. People refer... people get into Kajabi, and then they stay in Kajabi mm -hmm. because they are then part of not just the Kajabi community as a whole, but the part of my community, and they get the input from me because that relationship has been built. They buy in, and it's not then just a severed relationship. Oh, I've got another referral in through the door. Let me focus on getting more in. It's just about fostering that, and that culture of family, that culture of community that is very much Kajabi. Mm -hmm. If you do that within your own business as well, then it's going to dovetail and they're going to work so well together. Yeah. Thank you so much, Ant. I really appreciate your wisdom. Um, I love how authentically you bring yourself to the table and you always uh, blow me away with how you continue to cultivate community um, and the way that you think about Kajabi as ingrained into your business. I think it's so unique and I think it's incredibly smart um, and it's going to help your referrals lifetime uh, to continue to grow and utilize the platform. And um, I just think that what you're doing is affecting other people's lives because it's allowing them to have a business that they're passionate about that is actually successful. Um, and so thank you so much for being a Kajabi partner and we can't wait to see what you do next. No problems. And I'm sure I'll be flying over soon. There'll be some high fives. Yes, we have to have you over. We have to have you over <laughs> soon. <laughs>